She came back home to her Syracuse roots this weekend after winning Miss America. Oh my goodness, just I'm so happy to be home. Um, truly, the community of Syracuse has really made me feel like Miss America even before I won the title. Um, so to be back here and you know represent a wonderful community is really amazing. Nina Davaluri came out dressed in a traditional Indian sari when she graced the stage at the Landmark Theater in Syracuse to perform a Bollywood fusion dance during an event with other top Miss America finalists. The different passions that the girls on the stage had um, to represent from all different, you know, all different, all different regions of the whole America as a whole. Um, it was great. The excitement continued backstage here at the Landmark Theater as 25 girls from four area boys and girls clubs across Syracuse took some time to snap a picture or get an autograph during some one-on-one -on -one time with their role models. I truly think that this will be inspiration to them to continue their goals, their dreams. And that was the overall statement from a lot of the girls was to chase their dreams. And that's what these girls need to hear. They're just like, wow. I'm one of the girls I had kept waving, um, kept trying to say hi to her when she was on the stage. So I think it was just a really good feeling that they got to experience. To finally have a platform such as Miss America to be that role model, the attainable role model that they can meet and touch and see she's a real person, um, and to be that good, wholesome role model is really what our country needs right now. So I'm so honored to have this opportunity. The opportunity of a lifetime these young girls will not soon forget. Reporting from Syracuse. I'm Alex Rosilla.